we are live let me refresh and make sure we are good to go no no echoes everything looks good make sure the lighting is good i think next time so the first time the jersey color helped so i think i'm gonna have to change and wear going forward like a brighter color or or we could just mess with your setting have to no, no, no. Brighter color it brings out the mocha in my eyes. Uh, the mocha in you. Yeah. <laughs> now you look like Toke Force. <laughs> yeah, pretty much at this point. Let me see. Let me see who's here. Go back up. Um, Brownton finds James. Uh, James, there we go. He says Buenos dias. Ah, uh, James. The man misinformation. George saw you today at Ross on the West Side. Um, most closet one kick finder, Mr. Eric. Mr. Eric, are you at work? Are you at home? Are you sourcing? D Bay, William Perry, um, Brian, it's been a minute. Glenn, how is sourcing been? A little bit better this week. Um, we'll have a Ross video for Friday. Working on it. Dapper Fanatic, hope you model that jacket. So I do have it here. I don't know what to do with it yet. I'm still deciding, but I have to get it cleaned. Right. Uh, let me see. One kick finder. My Vero the other week from Nike in Europe. Vero about 12 items that was unlisted and unable to be relisted. Tried to end some of my Nike and Jordan items to sell similar, and now I can't list items that reported these items, but eBay hasn't taken them down. That's so weird. Yeah, that's super weird. You definitely have to. Did you call them? Yeah. Um, I want to see what their response is. How do they even come back to that? Josh Brown, what up? Price Assassins. Uh, AN. Uh, Manny Fresh. Pacers. Uh, let me see. Big Money Mo. AK Rowdy. Crispy. Lucky and Three Legs. Magnetic Souls. Hustle and Muscle. Brilliant Dominance. PK Adam. Rashard. Lighting looks like he next to the moon. <laughs> Rashard. Drip Emporium. Rock the kicks. Been missing the lives. Brilliant dominance. Uh, one. Oh, sorry. Sneaker flip fine. What up, fellas? Mr. Eric driving home. Too legit. What up? Let's see. Young JPEG. And I'm in class right now watching you instead. Crispy. I like mm -hmm. that. More education. All right, yeah, about this double video. learning right there. <laughs> Kevin Hawthorne, Mamo Dog, Hustle Crow, Michael, Miles, my boy Miles. And let me see, Stealthy Finds, Young Mizzle, more people coming in. All right, let's start off the show with, look, the numbers don't lie. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, there we go. Number one in the division going forward. And look, no one picked us to win. No one's picking us to win next week. I'll take it. Who do they play next week? Buffalo Bills. Oh. Yeah, it's gonna be it is gonna be a tough win. If plus true. they lost bad too. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, plus they're angry because Pittsburgh yeah. destroyed them, yeah. so they're not gonna be too happy about that. Two a time, yes sir. Um, how about them Raiders? Did you watch that game? Yeah, that was wild. I was like, yeah. I was like, man, they screwed it up big time, you know, because they didn't make that feel. Uh, they didn't make that score in the end zone, and then man, he threw it with, you know, with confidence. He knew <laughs> what he was gonna do. I was like, that was a. I don't know. Was it? You think it was a a called play or he was just a read? Um. No, I think it was a call play. I think that, and then they've already went through, and it was overtime and everything. And they're just yeah. like, it was a wild finish. I mean, yeah, it's like no safety, one world. <laughs> Raiders, 49ers, let's go! Brilliant dominance, too legit. Looking for Dolphins gear for you. Appreciate that. Any uh, bucket hats out there? Dolphins. I I oh. found like every other team, but, but Dolphins. I didn't, yeah, I didn't find Dolphins. You know All what? Right. Somebody. No, I, did, I didn't find Bucks. I didn't find you didn't. 
you found bucks? No, I didn't find bucks. Oh, actually. you got somebody got to find bucks because I gotta, did find raiders. We got to uh, do a show with a bucket hat. Oh uh, yeah, that's true. I did find raiders and jags, and what else did I find? Patriot. I found patriots. Ah, oh, yeah, they're old news. Now. Come on, guys, they're old news. Select goods. What up, Niner gang? Looking three legs. Go Cowboys, RNG. Sorry, Cowboys. Uh, hope you keep that jacket. Miles, appreciate that. I do have it here. I do want to keep it. Someone said to go get it dry cleaned, but. Yeah, you have to. Yeah, because I, I don't know. If I, I don't trust myself with anything. Right, you um, might get sick. <laughs> <laughs> so I don't know. I might end up just destroying it or something. Yeah. Um. All right, let's go to the next. A lot of like first looks, oh. which is weird. So first look, Jordan Six UNC. I believe this is for next February. Man, they just milking the UNC, huh? Ah, uh, UNC everything. Dude, I uh, I can't lie though. The tongue on this one looks clean. If, if it was gonna come out like that. Yeah. So now but, I don't know. But this it is their doesn't. Mock -up. But it doesn't though. No. Oh yeah, it doesn't. This is the mock up. I don't know what, what this is gonna look like. Uh, Smasher Pass, what do you what do you guys think for the collection? Fire, not fire. I want to know. Miles, not bad. Uh, let me see. Fire, sneaker flip, fine. He likes. So um, if you dry clean it, some other stains might show up. The solution they use might bring it out. Hmm. Interesting. Fire, fire, fire. Everybody likes these. Personal. Clean shoe. So everybody's liking these. UNC 6. Sixes are nice. Jordan Six will never be hype. L coming. Hustle and muscle. So I, I think it's a clean shoe. Well, there you go. All right. So everybody thinks it's a clean shoe, including B. Next. What about Chili Red? Roller boats. Yeah, as I said, very similar. Uh, this is a little bit brighter red, I believe. And we do have a patent that goes around. So it's kind of like the OG. Yeah. So we got this patent here. Uh, what do we think in the chat for the Jordan 9? I'm afraid it's going to be infrared, though. Mm, look different right? in the photos. But if it's chili red, if it's red red, I think it's going to be clean. Yeah. Uh, let's see. Doo Doo select goods. Yeah. Uh, what are jo uh, Boat Jones back? So it's very similar. I guess they're not really calling that since it's a little bit brighter, I believe. I don't know. Let's see what they actually look like. This is just photos, so right, right, right. yeah. A resale all day, smash. Uh, let me see, Dookie. Uh, not mad. It looks like Thriller. <laughs> not safe to wear. Activate hustle mode and fire RJ. Big red clown shoes, but they'll still make the money. Price Assassins. Mm -hmm. Price Assassins. What have you been rocking on feet? Oh, Baby Max Flying It Three. He's been a fly neck guy. Yeah, the I wonder South what Beach. he's been rocking lately. South Beach. South Beach. Next, another first look. What's these first looks? Jordan 5, Jade Horizon. Oh. <laughs> Come on. That's weak. I don't even know this is even coming out. Or I mean, They're just milking a bunch of retros that all of a sudden they're just going to release, I guess. Right, right, right. Oh, wow. Price Assassin's rocking old dirty Pumas. Oh, he did rock. <laughs> <laughs> Let's see, Moldy oh, Jordan that's Five. It was raining, Glenn. It was raining. He's oh, raining. It was he raining. Was dirty. Oh, okay. Uh, pistachio Fives. Pass. Off white cheap version. Those are a cop. Looks like off white. Brilliant dominance. SA, what up? District Deals, what up? Uh, buy those for sure. Looks like off white. I don't know. I mean, let's see what they actually look like. But I don't even know any of this stuff was coming out. Right. And the silver splatter looks a little weird with green, like a light green. I don't know. Do you think they look good together or? They should have made it green. You know what I'm saying? Tie it all together. Mm -hmm. Looks like toilet water. Next. Jordan 3, Kello. Yeah. <laughs> I'm not going to lie. Uh, here we go. Come on, you know how I like my trees, trees wacky. You know, like two pairs minimum. Bruh. No. Yeah. I'm, I'm, sh I'm shocked that you like this one. You, you, 
you know, like I like to rock olive though, black and olive. That's kind of like my color. And and if the quality's this good, man. All <laughs> right, for everybody that said they're gonna pass, cop one for me. Hook me up for retail. I'll buy as much as I can. <laughs> good for hunting season. Here's the thing. I am a fan of like the different materials. I'm kind of right. interested to see how this is gonna come together. Right, right. The patchwork style, yeah. right? But this first look, I'm I'm not I'm not really feeling it that much. I don't know. We'll what see. does everybody sell and say here in the chat? You know what? I'm willing to go out and say I'd rather rock Billy Eilish AJ KO than this. What does it look like? <laughs> it's like a whole bright ass lime green. <laughs> oh yeah, it, well that's two different things though, because like you know, I'd I'd rock like flashy colors, but this one mm. though, I think this one's kind of like a daily for me, you know, like, oh, like daily. Yeah, like I would replace you know black cement, you know, because like black cement's getting beat up for wear too much. <laughs> I'm gonna wear these with joggers. I'll copy a pair B hunting boots. Uh, All right. Fear threes two point oh vibe. Right. Okay. Okay. I see um, you. B swag kinda... still in twenty ten. Big money mo. Ah no. Twenty ten. I wasn't born yet. What are you talking about? Y'all old. <laughs> uh, depends on the material. Can't tell the quality of the material. Cool kicks. Right. Dude, I, I'm 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 really feeling that this is gonna be that one that's gonna have really good material, and from the looks of it, I, I'm like. I like unique takes on this one. Okay, um, I'm, I'm, yeah. I'm curious. I'm curious. Right, like, like I do have like a bunch of like non OG threes, you know, the Justin yeah. Timberlakes, uh, Tinker Hatfields. Um, the, so, the but we'll see. I, I can't wait till somebody has it on feet. I think that that's gonna really um, solidify the decision. But I'm for sure gonna get one either way. But. But we'll see all this all these people i'm a screenshot all these people say <laughs> trash everything like that but yeah it might be 240 retail so that or might be 250 and that might flop until travis wears it and then yeah next see, thing you know see, this, he's got the travis vibe you see where they're going <laughs> they took the mocha they took the travis the travis sixes and then you know Travis Scott wears this, or somebody big wears this. You know, people. Game over. If they were people rock this to salute the service things, oh look! Imagine with my Tampa Bay salute the service jersey with uh, this one. <laughs> You're ready? No. This guy. I, I think it's a clean shoe. All right. So he said it's clean. Let's see what happens when they do release this year, right? I believe. Yep. I think. Into the news, not what you wanted to see. I'm going to read you this whole article. Oh, okay, okay. This is for everybody that's been asking about Nike. What's going on with Ross? What's going on with the outlets? What's going on with everything? This, uh, this thing came out today or yesterday. There's two different articles. This one I think was a better one. I'm going to read you the main parts of this thing. So... Nike could lose production of 160 million pairs of shoes due to, of course, that word, related facility closures in Vietnam. Now, the Nike stock falls 2.5% after downgrade, dragging Foot Locker Dick Sporting Goods down with it. So, <laughs> man, <laughs> here we go. Let me see. Um, it slipped 2.5% uh, on Monday from trading. So after it was downgraded to neutral from buy um, based on supply chain challenges in Vietnam. Now, they, here's what the analysts, of course, what they say. Okay, okay. Um, they said the impact to Nike could be felt as far as into the future as spring 2022, which mm -hmm. we kind of talked about as well with Big Money Mo um, and saying how, you know, the outlet even from the people we talked to at the outlets, it was like, you know what, probably not until next year, we'll see some, you know, more items come in. Uh, we believe the risk of significant cancellations beginning this holiday and running through at least next spring has risen materially for Nike as it is now facing at least two months of virtually no unit production. 
um, in wow. its factory. So it accounted for 51% of footwear and 30% of apparel units last year. The analyst wrote in the note of the estimate Nike has lost 40 million pairs of shoes a month to production halt or 80 million pairs total. Um, so this compares to the estimated three, uh, 350 million that were made last year in Vietnam. So about half, 50% production capacity. Now, see, even when facilities switch on again, they anticipate a slowdown due to social distancing and time it takes to ramp up production back up. They forecast a five to six month period before factories are back to normal including eight weeks to work through the backlog. And uh, by our math, we now assume footwear unit growth could be down minus 13%, partially offset by plus 3% pricing. And so through Nike has been focused, although Nike has been focused on its direct to consumer business, retailers like Foot Locker, Dick Sporting Goods are still significant partners. And both of those shares also slipped. And last, this last little part here, Nike stock has been most tightly correlated with sales growth. So with growing evidence that sales will likely stall, we believe Nike stock will at best tread water until more clarity is had around its manufacturing issues and at worst suffer from reduced sales guidance and ensuing multiple compression. And while Nike typically is incredibly well equipped to manage such disruptions, we fear this issue is just too large to control, even for the best run athletic brand in the world. Mm -hmm. That's the way they're going to end it. Let's see what the chat says. What does B have to say? I Figures. Mean, I mean, not, 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 not shocking. But. It's not shocking, but now finally they're putting out numbers and stuff like that, right? I mean, I mean, we see it, right? Like, I think, you know, we, we have, like, somewhat of a pulse on what's really going on just because on um, you know when we've never seen nike outlet been dry like this mm -hmm, mm -hmm. and and you know we could always speculate as much as we can but but what's happening in the behind the scenes but we're definitely seeing the results of slow pro slow production stop production you know compare uh partner with high demand uh, so we'll see. Uh, let me see what the chat has to say. Price your shoes high, everyone, like in three legs. Uh, maybe worth raising the prices over the holidays, brilliant dominance. Vietnam may close until October, I heard. Sneaker flip find. Not even any additional sales anymore. RJ Beast. All they have to do is open a warehouse in deep southeast. Never worry about a state shutdown. <laughs> Tyler is green. Um, let me see. That is why I've only been finding clothes. William Perry. Uh, Jake was right. Reebok all the way for now. This is Danny. <laughs> hey, they uh, have problems with mids coming in. Uh, select goods. Don't worry. They're still making the bootlegs. Inflation on Nike products. Extra grands. This is how RBX is going to dethrone Nike. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, let's see, extra grands, what up? It's a plug. I'm going to try to get a job at Nike. Let you know what I can find out. Um, let me see. B about to buy out a whole Nike store. He can if he would. He can if he can. Let me see. This The pulse is weak right now. Price Assassins. Joyrides are about to sell for $300. Uh, <laughs> even when supply chain gets caught up, discounters are the last in line getting the goods. Would you agree? Agree, agree, agree. Uh, means there'll be there'll be a flood or at least appearance of one when it finally opens up. That swoosh is unraveling into a flat line. <laughs> <laughs> now I feel like, you know what? This might turn into, you know what I was kind of thinking when I was at Burlington today and the line was super long and there was no Nike in sight. I was like, I wonder with less stores getting Nike, would this make nike just more desirable like right not necessarily like oh above and beyond premium brand right, right, but right, right. really moving it up to like man if i really want to rock that swoosh i'm gonna have to pay up yeah because it's not gonna be that common anymore 
um, you know, and we know that it's kind of like, I guess, consumer behavior. It's if it's something that's harder to find, more, you know, tougher to get, it's going to have more value to it, right? Yeah. So you're gonna have that street credit or the fashion credit of you getting <laughs> it, rocking it, because you know there was a point that Nike was, you know, was everywhere, right? We haven't checked what famous footwear or stuff like that if they have Nikes, but you know what I'm saying. But with a, even with the Air Max, you know, Vapor Max, right? Like they're getting really hard to get. I mean, at a good price for us. So so now it's like all those. I would say mid to high end Nikes are easily going for more than retail now. Um, Big Money Mo, their website will still be fully stocked, which I do agree, fully stocked to an extent. Because I mean, yeah. even the Hirachi sold out, like yeah, on mm -hmm. the sneakers app, which we'll talk about that. But they also had the new NFL Pegasus. Some of those sizes were already gone pretty quickly. Yeah. Um, so how you know they have to keep up with that. I, I don't know. Let's see what happens with, with a lot of the new releases. Mm -hmm. There were two groups of tourists at Ross asking the restock lady if they had Nike shoes, Mamo Dog. Mm -hmm. um, even looking at stocks, Nike is going to boom if we ever get out of this. Cole's got Nike, you know it. To an extent, too, but even then, um, I've heard they just have like the basic tees that Ross, I mean, Ross has basic Nike tees. Yeah. Nothing special. Um, and Kohl's has kind of the similar uh, mids on Amazon are crazy prices right now. Time to buy some stock. Could be. Uh, let me see. So with this kind of inventory struggle, why are they opening new stores? <laughs> Intro more. Because uh, moms are still buying mirrors and curtains and pillows and blankets. <laughs> if you could get a part time job at any store that you source at, which would you choose? Nike for sure. Just with the employee discount. Um, I would probably say DD's discounts. Um, yeah, yeah. You can't say <laughs> Nike because Ross might fire him. <laughs> I can't say any of the competitors because I'll lose my yeah sponsor. You know, he's uh, yeah, he's board yeah. board seat. Yeah, we're not. Yeah, we're not. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Are you gonna buy mids to hustle oh. me? <laughs> <laughs> Never, <laughs> <laughs> man. You're hearing straight from the man. Never, I mean, ever. <laughs> so there you go. I would rather buy this than buy a pair of Jordan mids. I said. Uh, well, I meant, why are they still opening new Nike stores? Mm -hmm. <laughs> I don't even know. Well, I think just the regular retail stores. Are they doing outlets too? I didn't see any new outlets. Maybe they are. Mm -hmm. Let's go to some good news. How are your sales? I'm guessing doing better, doing better, doing better. <laughs> it's it's about to. Uh, I feel like the uptrend, you know. Oh, okay. Uh, in the chat, how are your sales? eBay, StockX, go. Do you care about StockX anymore? I haven't sold. I mean, I think my, I think all my listings on StockX expired already. Your seller rating is going to go down, and you're going to pay uh, twenty five percent uh, fees now. Fees. Okay, I guess <laughs> I'll sell something there, some mix. <laughs> For break even. Let me see. Go, Mr. Eric. eBay slow. Amazon on fire. Slow. Go is killing it. StockX is okay. Sales up on eBay. Uh, trash just fell off. Tyler. Uh, let me see. eBay is slow. Hustle Crow. Um, yes, moving a lot of my retros on StockX. Big money mo. Go is booming. S A. Uh, let me see. Really expensive shipping on StockX. I agree. Had my first hiccup with Goat Intramorph. Uh, what was that? What, hap what happened? Mm -hmm. eBay Mercari paying the bills. Mercari. Right. Definitely a lot of people going to Mercari. Well, and, and here's what I'm going to to everyone. As long as we're paying the bills and then we're not underselling our inventory, we're not rushing, we'll, re we'll weather through this storm. Keep and, doubling, tripling the money. Yeah, that's all we got to do, right? Like, I mean, you know, you see hustler hacks out there thrifting. <laughs> you got to find ways, you know? <laughs> you know, it's putting out more content out there and thrifting. 
Um, but at the end of the day, right? Like, I, you know, I, I, we'll see all the finds, you know, even the clothing. I mean, I'm not a snob for clothing. I rather buy clothing than mids. Yeah, here we go. <laughs> Uh, stock is only good for older models. Mercari stepping it up. Glad to see it. Miles, preach B. Uh, let me go back up and see. Mercari slipping for me, though. S-A. Um, let me see what else we had on here. Sales will go up with no products hitting stores. Thus, Xmas because uh, of distribution. So, yeah, should see more. Mm -hmm. uh, let me see. Merch by Amazon Mooning, Gordon. Actually happy I don't feel guilty not driving eight hours a day, big money mo. Mm. So there we go. All right. Uh weekend releases. This came out today. This is the one I was telling you. Harachi's selling out like 120. I thought we talked about this one, no? I maybe thought we talked we about did. a similar one, maybe. Yeah, we uh, did like uh like the Hornets colorway. Right? Mm. Bigger brand, 140 watching. Only 34 likes, hit that like button. So, selling out, Hirachi's selling out. Yeah. Just because it was on Sneakers app, I guess? I don't know, because, like, you would think this would have been, like, a summer release shoe, right? But now it's like we're getting into fall. So, I'm I'm feeling that this should have been the summer release, but it got delayed. Mm. Uh, let me see. Also, the Sakai. Yeah. Waffle. Fragment. 170. 170. Yeah, anybody hit on this? Light smoke, gray mesh, and suede. Mm. Uh, let me see. Oh, Harachi, I saw these at the mall, full size run. A N. Hit that like button. I agree. M K. Let me see. Hustle Cross says L. Uh, let me see. Hustle, are you killing it? Recent top five Jordan videos. Appreciate that, Samuel. Uh, well, I don't know. Tomorrow I'll have a new one. I got to see what. Uh, I think I'm gonna do Jordan Eleven lows. Or Jordan 14s, one of the two. L's, L's, L's all around. There you go. W, size 7. W, size 12. Hype beast poppy. Didn't even try. <laughs> DJ, L, like in three legs. All right, next. This one comes out tomorrow. I did see it in the Foot Locker app. Women's Jordan 14 low, iconic red. Uh, was there a need for this? I mean, that I mean, I'm not gonna lie. It's a good colorway, you know. It's sticking to Chicago Bulls black red thing theme. What works uh, for them? <laughs> yeah, I think I think it works. You know, it's not like one of those random wacky colors. Um, one seventy, you know. One seventy, and it's also a women's colorway. Yeah, which women's is tough even on ones. I mean. So for a 14 low, I don't know. Dope for women. Nope. No, but clean. Big money mo. 14s ain't bad. Comps are good on these big sizes. Miles. Uh, we're not getting them, so I did look it up. And eh. Nothing. No thanks. Pass and pass. Next. More dunks. Who's ready? Uh, this one, Dunk Low Championship Red. It's a clean bucks. shoe. It's a clean shoe. I'm not going to lie. Yeah. Um, exactly. Uh, but it, 100 bucks. I, I think it's a clean shoe. Yeah, 100 bucks. I'll take that over the Rachis. <laughs> for sure. But, but well, we're not getting them. I did look it up. I said to say, I forgot to put in on them. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Oh man! Yeah, price assassins wouldn't be happy. Oh, price I totally, assassins! I totally forgot. Like I, I look at the clock and it was like five oh five. I was like, like, is, am I missing something? And then I was like, ah, oh, it's a Thursday drop. That usually mm. never happens, though. You know. Very uh, true. B does have a lot going on, so. Right, right. We got, we got some stuff lined up. Uh, they don't release until 28 on sneakers, says Brian. Uh, not too shab. RJ Beast. Already got my W's. Price Assassins. Ready to go. Oh, For see? The personal. W on Foot Locker app. The plug. Man. W's all around. So, yeah, released everywhere, though. Dunks got pushed back. Austin. 
Next, Jordan 11 low, i.e. bread. B said he would actually, would you rock these? You said you would rock them, right? Yeah, yeah. Okay, 175? Oh, I know. <laughs> 175 <laughs> on back wall plus birthday key one, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, 175. Ugh. Hey, 25th anniversary. Oh, yo, I'm not I'm not paying retail for any IE or even non-OG 11s. <laughs> <laughs> this is how I know they're watching or listening. Um Chance. Oh, new dunks coming soon. University Red. I hate that. Like you talk about it. You're talking about a food thing, and then like next thing you know, ad comes up on your Facebook or IG. It's like, oh, what do you know? I was just talking about this food. Right. Now they're targeting me for ads. Listening to everything. <laughs> Can't oh. stand it. This live show's done. <laughs> right, right, right. All right, uh, let me see. Yeah, everybody that watched the show got the notification. Oh, just okay, the good. ones that watch the show. <laughs> oh, okay, good. Okay, just making sure. Just, yeah, just the ones that are watching the show. Uh, those are OG colors, though. SA just got my push notification, too. Price Assassins, they're watching us. Uh, they always are, always will. Uh, next, Jordan 13 Obsidian. How do we feel? Tell me how I should feel. Bruh. B. It's like somebody from Tennessee Titans would wear this. That's about it. <laughs> Who got destroyed by the Cardinals, by the way. Anyway, one night, yeah. Saturday, September 19th. How do we feel? Charlotte Hornets-esque obsidian. Kind of. I mean, like the, yeah, I, the bottom. I think, but... Yeah, I think the people that like navy blue, blue, that colorway, you know, like yeah. that rock Charlotte. The you the people that like UNC they might like this, but I'm just you know I'm just you guys know it's black and red all day. Super gr a n yeah yeah hornets yeah. asks hustle crow yeah kind of. Uh, let me see. Blair will sit for one week, maybe two. So Sam yeah, they'll sit and then they'll eventually sell out because people are be like, okay, and you know they're gonna they're not gonna appreciate this. And then they take else on everything else, and then they end up buying this. Next thing you know, it's on a top five Jordan video. On yeah, Tuesday. two years. No, right. Jordan 13, nobody wanted. And here it is. Hold for Christmas. Yeah. Um, well, Flint, for Christmas. Flint sevens are still at every store I go to at the mall. Not every store, but I've still seen some. Most, yeah, yeah. Yeah, most of them. Still yeah, are. hold for Christmas for $50 profit. <laughs> <laughs> Hold for Christmas 2023. Uh, the two year, was, the two year, right? Yeah, two year. Yeah, two year. Okay. And last one, Hustlebee colorway. That honey. More, Boost 700. More like honey flux. More like puke. Like 220. You much, yeah, you ate too much honey. And then you had honey reflux. And this is what you get. <laughs> uh, 220, man. Just pushing it here. Sporty silhouette in yellow upper with mm. black accents. And of usual, 700 numbering printed across the side panel. Yeah. Let's see, trash. Honey mustard. <laughs> Honey mustard. Yeah. Yuck, what are those? Trash. Uh, let me see. Boo. <laughs> Are you plugging a bid for 2022? Duds. Subway Sandwich 700s. Yeah, nobody's, nobody's liking these. So that's on Monday. All right. Power rankings. But we're not going to start until you hit that like button. Baker oh, Brand yes. doesn't have to tell you every time. Right, right, you know, right. 150 people watching. Just hit that thumbs up. Helps us out a little bit, especially from when we had Jake on here. Um, YouTube had to do a whole review, and so no ads or anything on that video since Jake was saying whatever he wanted, which I told him he could. <laughs> but um, <laughs> you know what happens on those things. YouTube, they're trying to censor. 
everything. Mm. This is just ranking. Um, let's see, Ross versus at Nike. Come on, this is last week. Um, Jake isn't advertiser friendly. No, he is not. Um, what power though? <laughs> All right, here we go. Marshalls one, Mamo Dog three hundred dollar Balenciaga T-shirt. <laughs> <laughs> That sounds like somebody needs to uh, get me this for Christmas or something. <laughs> Taxing on the Balenciaga T. Yeah, what is a retail? It'd be a shame if that 300 tag fell off. Uh, let me see. Did we freeze? Let me check. Okay, no, we're no. okay we're good. Uh, what up? Mendes Fines. $300 at Marshalls is too high. Too damn high. Yep. Man, look how plain this T-shirt is too. I know. Wow, it's not even like you know, like embossed or stitched. You know, come on, at least have it stitched. No, it's screen printed. Man, oh, it's probably even heat press. <laughs> <laughs> probably <laughs> three hundred bucks. Uh, Jared, what's up? Knows my cousin. We go Zubia family. They're they're everywhere. South oh, Carolina. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We met San Antonio, met Texas. We did meet her out there. You need that rent is too damn high clip. Exactly. This is when you do the good old switcheroo on Miles. Yeah, this is where you price match with a SpongeBob t shirt. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, right. The same color, everything. Yeah, yeah. What are you talking about? Yeah. Uh, maximum 2300 and sneaker flip find. We got the Seahawks jackets camo. Oh. Salute the service. And more Jalen Smith jersey flood cowboys. What? What's the story of Jalen Smith? So apparently he changed his number. Oh, okay. And so now all of number fifty. Isn't that the guy that he said he was gonna sign him, sign it, or something like that? I think that was a guy for the Jaguars. I think. Oh, okay. I did see that article or yeah. something about him. Yeah, but I said yeah, but yeah, that's that's sad. But Cowboys. Cowboys don't even know who the players are, so they can rock those. <laughs> Low Boys SA. Uh, let me see. Yeah, this is pretty dope, though. Three of them. I don't know the price, though. Yeah, I think if that one's 30 bucks, I think you'd have to get those jackets. Because <laughs> one thing we know, anything Salute to Service in Seattle, I mean, they do well. Very I true. A um, bunch of different hats. Try sneaker deals, Cubs, and Pro Bowl. And Cleveland Browns, AK Rowdy, Souls and Stitches, TJ Maxx smoking crack with these prices, twenty eight bucks <laughs> on the T-shirt. Yeah, you can get them <laughs> on uh, Under Armour outlet. <laughs> All right, shout out from Dallas. There we go. Next, more of the Ralph Lauren out there. KS reselling, AK Rowdy. DJ grabs twenty bucks under armor. Fire Lane store twenty five dollars on the Don issue two. Unfortunately, ginormous sizes eighteen and nineteen. Man, here we go. Burlington, um, Sin City Hustle. <laughs> what, what happened here? <laughs> Sounds like the the tagger dude. You know, works for both companies. <laughs> Burlington lost her identity through all of this. What happened? <laughs> uh, twenty-five bucks Burlington yeah. price, but twenty-eight Ross price. Yeah, they undercut Ross. They ah, uh, of course. So Burlington undercutters. I knew it. Yeah, showing their true colors. Uh, Rushlington, Ross Shallington. And so I don't know what, <laughs> how does this even happen though? Like even I, when they go to return it or what? Yeah, I've seen TJ Maxx though. I've seen yeah. TJ Maxx. Yeah, that's how, see, I'm wondering if like the dude returned it to Burlington with a Ross tag and they just, <laughs> and then the cash register was just really out of it. And just like, okay. Yeah, that's great. It. I'll take it in. They're desperate for inventory, Giovanni. Oh, well. <laughs> uh, fire lane store let me see reversible vest and free shoes they were switched out and left in store 
<laughs> I was like, it just took him. So the dude had a vest, I guess. Well, the vest is is actually part of the thing, right? But I found oh. him and told him outside, "Can I get a bag and then free shoes?" <laughs> <What>? <laughs> oh man, dude, it sounds like that's like a prank waiting. I wouldn't even touch it. <laughs> And then uh, Funky finds. Look at the. Whoa, <laughs> this is I was like, I, I tried to, you know, get a collab, but you know, <laughs> Nike, is, Nike, Nike's factory very close. So this I had is to bad. Settle. I mean, our power rankings just turning into memes at this point. <laughs> <laughs> like this is what we're what we're down to. I don't know what else to say. Uh, what is a what is a cool name for this shoe? Vapor ass. <laughs> uh, just straight vapor ass. Yeah. Uh, vapor trash. Uh, yeah, big money mode. There we go. RBX vapor ass. I mean, how would they do that to us? Bruh. Uh, but man, like, I wonder how many of them they have. I get as many different colors, everything they want. Yeah. One step in these, and you know, this thing's just going to explode. Yeah, put sure. some zip tie on it. It's off white. Oh, trade it yeah. into Plato's closet. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> give me like seven bucks uh price under a hundred <laughs> let's see this is so depressing when you get hype and then the second realize vapor ass yeah. no but they're still good finds yeah, real yeah. deal thrifter 40 yeah, bucks yeah. ohio state columbia jacket mm. they're saying that's a good local sale right right uh richard nice nike jacket out there Sneaky flips. I think it was like a Gore-Tex jacket. Picked up those thirty-six dollars. That the Adidas one, right? Um, I, bl- I don't remember. I believe so. Uh, Sin City Hustlers also with the jumpsuit. Jordan. Oh man, come on, jumpsuit. <laughs> Still haven't found one. Still haven't found one. Uh, this is where uh, New Balance going wild. Still, <laughs> uh, ninety bucks on the New Balance. Fifty bucks. Slim Pickens. Uh, we also have Doc Martin's camo, Wind Horse. And hey, you want to rock the swoosh? You got to earn it 70 bucks. <laughs> <laughs> That's um, what I've been playing, man. And watch it. It'll be gone next week. <laughs> you want them? Got to earn it. Not going to be easy anymore. Yeah. Let's see what the chat says. So the black ones, 180. I'll take that Hustle B colorway vapor asses over Jordan 1 mids any day. Armand. Oh. oh. <laughs> Miles, yeah, 70 bucks. <laughs> Crazy. Let me see. Shoplifter, uh, shoplifters hitting my local Burlington and Ross. Giovanni. Mm. Next. What are they shoplifting? RBS. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, mirrors. <laughs> Uh, Slim Pickin still out here. Did find a swoosh here and there. Broadway oh, B, couple of wow. vests, and Richard PSG Jordan shorts for yeah. I think they're like twenty five bucks. Three X. <laughs> <laughs> are they three? What size is this? I mean, those are dope. Those are dope. They're over the hanger. <laughs> <laughs> Fine, in human size, those are yeah, dope. Yeah, yeah. Uh, let me see anything in the chat. They're cheaper on Nike, exactly. These prices are trash. Um, they're taking the Mario Lopez shoes. <laughs> I was happy to see that swoosh. 5XLT. See, Richard said XL. Still a human size. Next. Bobby oh. Hustles. Activate oh. Hustle Mode. Hustle Crow. No, no you make 65 for this. Oh. 65 for the Kamikaze 2. Sean Kemp. 75? Uh, how much what? How much did this sell for? 75. <laughs> this guy. Sean Kemp and Jake would be proud. Yeah, yeah. Those two guys. That's it. Uh, what are... All right. Smash or pass in the chat. I need to know. Are you picking these up? Are you leaving them yeah. behind? I'm picking them up and putting them in the trash. Oh, here we go. You knew B was going to go right at it. 65. See, see, that's what I'm saying. Reeboks, Reebok Alice are full of those. Uh, pass. What are they even going for? Dookie. I seen them in pass. Yep. 
Let me see. I saw today, and it's a shame, 65 last year, there were 40. The rebuts are 70 with box at the outlet. Yeah, 40 is doable because if it doesn't sell, you can gift it to someone. <laughs> <laughs> you know? Pass. Selling. Hard pass. Yeah. Pass at that price. Yeah. Pick up for 35. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, in their defense, they're just tagging you. They didn't buy this. Yeah, man. that's pretty just true. The just grand, tagging me. You know just saying? tagging me. No one's yeah. saying they bought them. Yeah. Um. So until, until we see comps and it's on listed on their store, <laughs> and that's when you lowball them sixty four ninety nine. This guy. Uh, when it price assassins, when it's dry like this, it's hard to not get desperate. <laughs> yeah, that's why um, I just stay home. Me. That's why I just stay home and take a nap. <laughs> 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 Remember that cart full of Reebok a few weeks back? Oh, I remember. You guys <laughs> torched that dude. <laughs> yeah, that's the last time he tagged Glenn. <laughs> exactly. He doesn't even tag me anymore. Block Glenn. <laughs> <laughs> Man. <I'm so> <laughs> <laughs> uh, let me see. But some folks did buy <laughs> Mr. Eric. Um, did you hear about the shoplifting ring that was busted? What? Two million worth of stuff, TJ Max Marshall, Southern California. Was this one late last year? I know that was like a huge thing. I don't remember if it was earlier this year, late last year. I don't remember. But I did hear about something like that. Activate hustle mode. <laughs> Big money. Well, <laughs> some reason they're trying to buy itself for sport, not profit. I mean, <laughs> for sport. <laughs> I mean, <laughs> I mean, it could be hobby, right? Like, <laughs> nobody said that reselling can't be a non-profitable hobby. Oh, here we go. <laughs> oh, I mean, man. I mean, right? Just keep churning credit card points, you know? 1%, 2% cash back. Um, <laughs> that'll buy you, you know, pay for your gas and coffee. Uh, let me see. This just happened this week. Oh, there we go. So I'm gonna maybe I have to get it for next week though. And get I have to find the story. Then we'll we'll look into it. Yeah, find find out who the guy is and who the who his the collaborators are. <laughs> <laughs> Nonprofit eBay store. Hey, yeah, yeah, I mean it's not taxable. <laughs> <laughs> Big money mo one and a half still out here. Of course, doing his thing. Jordan boxes, uh, dunk, everything undefeated. Um, those those uh, better stuff on here going to the next uh, photos. Big Money Mo. Uh, Bam 24 kicks. Surprise, these are still out there. I think picked up, what, four pairs, six pairs, wow. something like that. Very nice. Uh, some of the ones, the 12s, sneaker flip find. Nice little three-piecer. Sourcing code. Fragment Jordan long sleeve heels on StockX. There was some, I think, bids for like 110 or something. Mm -hmm. So good stuff. I don't know what the price was on them. Diaper Fanatic with the fives. And more. A sticker flip find 130 on the golf. So Man. what would your game plan be for this golf? It's only for 129 plus shipping. No fees. <laughs> no, I, I, are gonna? Or do you think that they're gonna go down back wall? Well, use as many coupons as possible. Wall, there hasn't been a sale. That's so true you gotta, too. You gotta find a coupon. You know, as uh, many coupons uh, as possible. Yeah, stack it five times, right? Um, but man, see, like this is when you like start reasoning with yourself, right? You start going around Nike store and you look at like. Man, so you grab it, you put it in your bag, right? Start walking around, and you go back and grab more. And the next thing you know, start doing numbers. Like, oh, I'll make this with my, you know, 10%, 15% discount plus my 2% cash back, you know, plus plus no fees on eBay, you know. I'm, I'm going to ship this on a poly bag, so I'm only paying $9. You're, like, making all the reasons why you should buy it, but... In reality, unless you have major discount, it's just like buying mids. <laughs> oh, and speaking of mids, here they are, one per person. Yeah. And this one, this one, they let you get two uh, because it's purple. 
Yeah, so, the purple, yeah. Yeah. Sourcing code, purple's back for round two. Newly released mids, pen, been popping up at the outlet, 80 bucks, says Big Bunny Mo. <laughs> so for all the fans of mids, they're showing up outlets. Yeah, yeah, they got snubbed big time. But, you know, the stock X kid seller bought them. <laughs> Bruh, I need that Nike outlet. Uh, pick up a few yesterday. There we go. Drop the hustler. All right. So this one, I don't know if you're ready for this one. Oh no. <laughs> so I found this car today when I when I was going to Ross. Ready? Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Somebody got Frank. <laughs> hey, putting it out there. Hey, at least he honest, right? Like he, he look, look at where he's trying to shop, right? <laughs> trying to sell with Ross, um, but yeah. But, oh man, uh, yeah, yeah, Armand, I'm the only Asian that hates mids. The rest of them <laughs> buy him up. <laughs> yeah. Uh, let me see. Vapor ass. Must be Glenn's competition. Yeah, must be Glenn's competition. Hey, Glenn, uh, do you have more of the tape <laughs> left? <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. Hey, Glenn, next time center it a little bit, all right? It's a little off to the right. Oh, sorry about that. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> uh, that's Jake's car. Um, let me see. Must be reseller. <laughs> uh, Glenn, going to get. What ban from ads next week? Uh, he also drives ads. <laughs> Is that paint or tape? Yeah, oh, man. Okay. <laughs> All right, let's go to the next. Broadway B, how's your spots looking? Man. That's a ghost town. Uh, Kleenex. Use Kleenex. Champion, it's kind of sad. <laughs> Some use mask. <laughs> <laughs> Who's putting Jake on blast? Drop the hustler. <laughs> Damn, dry. Nothing. Um, <laughs> this is rough. Hey, they got all the white shoes though. Uh, since he looks like that, says Price Assassins. Uh, you can hear the echo in that store. All right, let me see. Activate hustle mode. Project Rock. Um, IXO hustling and sneakers unite and Jose nine thousand. I think what seven bucks for the Nike shorts. We also got uh, let's see Dodgers. Um, I don't know what else is on here. Hardens. I don't know if the price is anything. Can't see the price on nothing. Um, let's see next. Fire Lane store. Looks like these Timberlands are coming back. I don't know what happened here. Rockets, 80 bucks. Wind horse. Um, Fire Lane store, both of these with uh, Timberland boots. 70 bucks on that one. What's a resale on those Adidas? Good question. Miles. I and mean, what was the price? I didn't, couldn't even see the price. Nothing. And this makes me want to get a snack. Uh, I know. What snack are we looking at today? Uh, the hot and spicy, of course. Hot and spicy. Let's see, Agassi shorts. There you go. I had to pick those up for the personal. Yeah, they're dope. Super clean and cheap. Seven bucks. Uh, Hardens. Oh, 45 bucks. There we go. It says Rocky Mountain resale. Uh, Richard. Look at that. Under the glass. Whoa. So that make sure you're keeping them nice and clean. Hey, they're giving He's, you the charger. They keep giving you the charger. It's probably like a five and a half or something. I think it had like super small sizes right now. So, and uh, reaction resells. Hello Kitty, bringing in the money. Yep. And of course, Tans finds. Oh man. <laughs> <laughs> Fun guy. <laughs> Would you rock this? Mm-hmm. Fun guy hoodie. I got some New Balance. I wonder how much they're selling. I wonder if they're selling good or not. Probably good. Uh, Agassi sells Quiet Hoodie Fire. Um, Hello Kitty Fire. Anybody else find uh, the hoodie? I want to know if they're selling good or not. 
Brian, Don Alpha Clee, Jose 9000, Hustle Crow, Gucci Glasses 140. 30 wow. bucks in the Reebok. Uh, Trail Experimental, Ash Lily at Ross, $30. Don Alpha Clee. Next. Here we go with the hat. Activate hustle mode. We got Chargers, Seahawks. There's more of them out there. They are. Oh, there you go. Sorry, no Dolphins at Hustler Hacks. I think they're they are six bucks. And retail, I think, for 35. Um, up flipping Don Alpha Cleat, Levi's Super Mario out there. And this hoodie, man, comps were insane on these. Which and one? even the listings were high too, like 200 bucks. Some of the comps are like 150. I don't even know. They're crazy. So Levi's Mario stuff, look out for that. And we have the Jordan Jackets out here, $40. Operation Retag, Real Deal Thrifter, Richard. Little this, little that. Also, Ralph Lauren Jacket. Yep. Next, Funky Finds, Furious Flipper, 30 bucks on the Jordan Jacket. That one's dope right there. Don Alpha Cleat and Justified Creations. Found two of them, one white, one in red. There we go. Ben, what's up? Jordan Jacket's fire. Jordan Jacket flooded. Furious Flipper, Brian, uh, Richard, and Bam24 Kicks, Polo Jackets, Jordan Jacket. And we got the Nike Jacket here in blue. A little bit of Sherpa action. Let's see, Jordan Jacket, Fire, All Day W on the Jordan Jackets. Drum the Hustler. Man, Hustle Richard's killing it. Yeah, Richard killing it out there. And let's see, you found that infrared six jacket for the keeps. SA Polo Green starting to get flooded, says Danny. Hard to, hard to well, had to pass on the polo jacket for 90 bucks. Miles. More polo. Don Alpha Cleo. Man, look at that one. Yo. I I would have kept it if I found it. That's wild. Yeah. That's kind of like a, a 40 year old me. <laughs> uh, Richard, these are pretty pretty cool too. We got that one. This yeah. one we, we already saw in Derby City. Uh, Funky finds out here with the hoodies. Um, anybody seen any of these out there? Yeah, I remember I bought one prior before reselling. I bought uh, a, a polo leather jacket. Mm. They retail for like two thousand nine hundred eighty something like that, or two thousand five hundred. And then I paid two hundred ninety nine at TJ Maxx. Man, and then I wore it for like probably two winners, and then I sold it for like five hundred fifty when <laughs> I started selling on eBay. Dang, so, so they're good investments. Oh, for sure. So the retail on the jacket nine hundred ninety eight dollars. Um, the Ross price was two nineteen. In case you wanted to know the details in the chat. Yeah, leather jacket 220. Uh, leather jacket fire. Leather one hard to find. And next, more of them. More polo. Uh, $100. Soles and stitches. Don Alpha Cleat again. Flipping kicks. And a rapid finds on the green one. Uh, here they still got the little uh, little paper on the, on the buttons and stuff. Yeah, it's kind of yeah, it's like the butt, yeah, the pins, the pins, yeah. not to get scratched. Yeah. And Funky finds again Jordan flight jackets, Don Alpha Clee, man, back to back. Synthetic filled jackets, both of these are dope. I like this black one. Um, Nomad Expert. Um, this one, what do they call this one? I know we've seen this design. They have like a React Presto, some other ones with this kind of like floral looking thing. Yeah, I forgot. Isn't it part of like the Niger or Brazil, something like that, right? Mm, no. I don't know. It might be. See, Black Jacket looks fire. Next, the last one Don Alpha Cleat, 
40 bucks on the Ultra Boost Oreo 5.0. Mm -hmm. And we also have Funky Finds two of the Nike SB NBA jackets. Hey, Ross is getting something. Right, right. I mean, I'm, these jackets are dope. Mm -hmm. MC Incorporated. Nike hoodie, more than athlete hoodies. LeBron selling good on StockX right now. So look out for the LeBron hoodies. Picked up 100 bucket hats. 100 of them. Going through the slides, man. Lions, Seahawks, Rams, Vikings, Packers, Titans, Jets, Broncos. I haven't seen any Broncos. Uh, Raiders, Giants. Let me see. Jackets are fire. Don F killing it as usual. Ultra Boost, Fire, Richard, Ultra Boost, only 40 bucks. Uh, NBA Jacket, Fire, says Victor. Oh, yeah, for sure. Jackets, Fire, found a red, blue, and white of the SB Nike Jacket, William Perry. Nice. Um, I want that Lakers one. Which one? Uh, the, the satin? Yeah. Like Jackets remind me of the uh, NBA referee coats. Yes, sir. I like that Ultra Boost Fire. A whole cart full, too. Mm -hmm. At least there's some hope. Something out there in the shoes. Power rankings this week. Ross, two. Nike, one and a half. <laughs> Just because. Not, not even three. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we can. Uh, three would be pushing it. Three, you know, I'd be working for Ross if I put Ross at three stars. <laughs> Uh, Burlington, this is like a 1.25, and Marshall's at one. Dennis is terrible. eBay Poshman, what up? Let me see, what was the Ross price on the SB NBA jackets? That's a good question. I don't know. Funky Finds, if they're still here. 160 plus watching, only 78 likes. Smash that like button before the giveaway Baker brand. Yeah, I remember I bought, um, Probably like twenty or thirty pair pairs of those jackets, but they were since we're in Ohio, they were all uh, the Cleveland Cavs, mm. and that's when they when you know when everybody left. I think that was two years ago, mm. and they were down to nine ninety nine. <laughs> <laughs> I quick I quick flip it for like forty bucks ship. <laughs> Man, Ibi Pashman, they all don't even add up to five stars. <laughs> <laughs> Wow. Uh, what are they doing? You're five? Almost six. Almost. Uh, let me see. Well, the, half stars, the half stars, yeah. Well, Ross don't count because Glenn's employed by Ross. <laughs> oh, okay, Ross doesn't count. Two stars, week, week again. Price Assassins. Yeah. Bring back All September right. 2020. Fine, so we don't forget <laughs> big money. Well, yeah, we should just do that. Like for next week, we'll just play September 2020. <laughs> Fine. <laughs> All right, next week, well, yeah, what was the finds this week in time? I'll do that Yeah. At the very end. I remember seeing those Cavs jackets be, I passed on them, Dapper Fanatic. Yep. Uh, and Palma SB jackets were 40 bucks. Mm. So there's the price on that. Let's do giveaway while we're here. 25 bucks. Eric watches YouTube. I paid you out. Let me know if you got the email and you got the payout. How many are listed on eBay? Oh man! All I need is the number. I don't. You don't nope. need to spell nothing out. I don't want to make it difficult. We're already past the hour. B's hungry. I'm hungry. <laughs> All right. Let me see. Let's see if somebody got it. Water finger time. <laughs> Let me see, Victor, very close. Man, how do we get to an hour for all those crappy finds? I don't know. Probably because that eating ass photo helped us buy some time. <laughs> Somebody had to have gotten this already. Uh, let me verify. Make sure. Josh Brown, you're one away.
Snicker flip find. Very close. I hate when they do this because then it goes like way too damn fast and then I gotta like skip through them and I wanna make sure I don't I don't miss out on the right winner. Nothing yet. No winner yet. Uh Lauren very close, three away. Alright, that's it. Nobody's winning this week's giveaway. No winner. B's calling it. Baker Brand, three away. Um, man. Nothing yet. Oh, crap. Not skipped a bunch. <laughs> we'll be here all damn night if we have to. Fine, maybe we won't, but... <laughs> Everyone's like, okay, I see the answer. Let me let me make sure. Okay, someone for sure did get it. I want to make sure they have the right one. Make sure they're awarded correctly. All right, they are not. Someone else beat them. And then that person got beat by the next person. Let me check. And we... Nope. Man. Swear I'm almost done. Okay, we have a winner. <laughs> uh, the correct answer is 48. Coach Steve. Coach Steve, you have one. You're right before the plug and right before D-Bay. At least on my top chat. So congrats. Email me. I'll send you your money. Get this out of the way. Hey, so C48 listing? That's not a flood. Not bad. There's a Jordan sh uh, shortage right now. A Nike shortage. Yeah, it's not a flood. Be gone in a month. Yeah, exactly. See, I like that mentality. That Mamba mentality that B has. Yeah. Uh, Jacket's ugly, says A N. <laughs> Got him, coach. Good, good stuff, Coach Steve. But are they selling? Says One Kick Finder. <laughs> Let um, me see. 48 listing and like five sold, Josh Brown. <laughs> Found so two and left one for months. RNG. You'll sell in 10 months. <laughs> <laughs> it's hard rocking in the color red, I think, says Connor. That's like hmm. Olympic leftovers or something. Um, right. Anything else you want to say, B, before we go? Nothing. I guess um, I've been really having fun doing the Monday my, mindset Mondays. So you know, oh, but he's looking forward to Mondays. He's he's done with the Wednesday shows. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mondays been like the you know more popular show now. <laughs> <laughs> Price assassins, would you buy mid before Adidas anything? Oh man, I'd rather buy Converse at that point. He has Adidas in his inventory. Yeah. And they've been right. here for years. <laughs> <laughs> uh, give us some inspiration. We are struggling. That's what the Monday shows is about. I know. I you guys need to watch Monday show. That was fire. I mean, and I actually, Mondays are fire. I actually scrolled through again just to see what I was, you know, <laughs> babbling about, and it was pretty good. I was surprised. I was inspired. All right. You know? So uh, Monday was like. You know, we go real things. We share we share struggles. We share personal experiences on Monday. Yeah. That's where, you know, we become humans. Personal goals, life goals, yeah. advice, yeah. personal stories. Yeah, I talk about, like, wanting a pool. That's what I rewatch it again. Like, man, I really want a pool because I talked about it. <laughs> yeah. So there we go. Activate hustle mode. Monday's lit. Preacher be killing it. You be poshman. Um, let me see. As a Phoenix fan, I almost got into Mamba mentality. Mile oh, high hustle. There we go. There we, there we go. go. Miles, appreciate that. Mindset Mondays, commercial free Mondays. Thanks to Jake. <laughs> <laughs> uh, let's see. Don't worry about things that's not in your control. Big money. Yeah. Goal. Very oh, true. One more thing, though. One more thing. Um, since you guys know that I'm into cars and stuff like that, 
there is actually a Netflix documentary film about Michael Schumacher, mm -hmm. um, the guy that owns the most, that's tied with the most championships with Lewis Hamilton right now. So growing up, that's why I was really into Ferraris because of Michael Schumacher, mm -hmm. um, you know, the, the, the red car. That's what I referred it to growing up. So if you guys are bored, rather watch an inspirational film than buy all of those. <laughs> she finds <laughs> Andromorph B's feed fading like Nike inventory. <laughs> He's down to 240p. Oh, wow. He's trying. Uh, what? No, see. not NASCAR <laughs> F1. <laughs> that would be funny. A Filipino into NASCAR. <laughs> <laughs> into NASCAR. Uh, well, what size do you want? Purple or yellow? Oh man, William Perry. I like that purple one. Oh, both. <laughs> Wait, what's the price on them? Uh, Danbury Trashers. I did see that one. Me and the wife watched that one. Trashers with their trash can logo. Hockey what team. What are those? Yeah, you should watch that one. What's that one? Uh, it's about like a hockey team and the dad was doing some mafia-like stuff for uh, oh, <laughs> this wow. trash business. and That one's cool. Okay, okay. Need that trashes jersey. I know Drake got one of the jerseys. He was flexing it. Mm. Drake also out there punching and showing his skills. He's ready to fight Jake Paul. <laughs> uh, let me see. B and Tesla collab. What do you feel? What do you like or dislike about Teslas? Well, give I us your honest opinion. I'm not. I'm not really a fan of it, just because it's. I feel like it's a very refined car already that that it really has everything you need. So I think, you know, there's no fun to kind of like, you know, adding into it. I feel like, you know, if there was a perfect car right now, it could be the perfect car. You know, uh, it's slick looking. I'm not saying I'm a fan of the design, but it's I, you can't lie that it's slick looking car. Um, the other thing too is the after sale support or you know it's terrible because only tesla can can work on it but as price assassin says plaid all day um you know their new tesla plaid model s plaid is like you know a nine second car 10 second car it's really fast right off the gate not doing anything to it right so I feel like that's kind of like, man, that's like kind of like, I feel like that's cheating. <laughs> it's like me going to my outlet and it's all breads 11. You know, <laughs> like, that's what it feels like. And at that point, it's not fun. Um, mm. But yeah, but I'll, I'll, I'll enjoy, you know, gasoline cars more than that. But I would say probably if it was a business expense, you know, something like that, I wouldn't mind, you know, adding it onto a fleet, you know. Uh, uh, but yeah, I'm big money mode Taycan, you know, Porsche. I would, you know, I would agree. That would be better. Um, let me see what people say. Tesla is a powerhouse so far ahead of e vehicles. Um, yes, it is good, but I, I do know somebody that's Tesla certified shop to work on them. The lower end Teslas have problems. And 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 because they're cheap, so a lot of their parts are cheaply made. Let's talk about the real business expense, and that is Tesla robot. Oh, can it list for you? Can it? Can list? it ship? Yeah. Um, how much will the bot cost? Prices start at four grand. Hmm. <laughs> but I think it said it could lift things. So, what would you have it do? I mean. List ship. Um, yeah, I mean, if if it could list and ship for me, and if it's cheaper than hiring a human being, I'd be all for it. But I doubt <laughs> it the source. Ah, uh, no, source will leave it to us because that would be the fun part. Yeah, that would be the fun. That's very true. All right, right, and yeah, four thousand. <laughs> that's all. Uh, that's what they're saying. Uh, that's what it says here. Prices start at four thousand. 
start of 4,000. 4,000 is the, the one that just stands. Right? <laughs> Another 4,000. Because you know how Tesla does it, man. Like, it's capable to do everything, but they got to charge you for every software update that they're going to give. Very true. You know? Um, um, but, yeah. Uh, did you know Tesla bot is taller than you? <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> Until it turns on you. Right, exactly. We've it's 5'8". 125 can deadlift 150. Yeah. Speed, 5 miles per hour. Yeah, yeah. Sneaker flip, fine, yeah. 4,000 for the shell. 10,000 for the AI. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> it's, 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 it's the – even the Tesla self-driving, right, the full autonomous driving – how much more it costs you for them to just unlock it on the thing. <laughs> so I'll wait till somebody can jailbreak, can hack the system until I get in Tesla. <laughs> it's 10K for full self-drive, so this would be more. <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> That's what I'm saying. Yeah, yeah. Elon's playing. Elon's playing the like the nerd wannabe futuristic wannabe cars car lovers or something like that this is irobot unfolding it can carry you around ross <laughs> have them do inventory and organize man so uh i don't even know if this thing's even gonna release they don't even know yeah they can't even figure out the glass of the cyber truck that broke oh yeah, <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> Get that crap out of here. Yeah, that's very true. All right? That's what I'm saying, right? Like, that was the most fail reveal ever. Uh, gas cars ain't going away anytime soon, says Big Money Mo. You agree? 100%. It won't go because, because you know why? There's so much money in oil. True. You know, the, the world runs and is supported by this oil companies there you know besides pharma pharmaceuticals it's oil that's it and everything's got to run through all these guys and all the politicians are fueled literally by these guys you know make their pockets fat so fatter yeah fatter yeah because they get one from pharma they get one from oil man you just you just want this thing to have no ads don't you <laughs> this, <laughs> this guy is just hey, right I, 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 I didn't mention anybody glenn i didn't mention anybody. Like, yeah let's wrap this thing up before we start talking truth <laughs> <laughs> save the truth for monday yeah 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 let's save the yeah let's let's keep glenn uh you know Income let's keep the channel safe for now. Yeah, yeah, that's true, that's true, that's true. We have to move to, you know what, you have to do some uh, some truth videos on Twitch. Now, Twitch is actually, they actually get on you for like minute, like small things. Like they don't want you saying oh, really? things either. So where can we go to uh, sp uh, spread the truth then? Oh, I knew it. Of course. base, baby. Of course. Um, All right, no, B going in says Miles. He was just getting started. We had to tame him a little bit. Yeah. Um, oh, yeah. Everybody there. knows. So like, good. They already know. They already know. <laughs> TikTok. Yeah. TikTok's taking things down too. Yeah. Everything is misinformation at this point. Even though there's clear data on things, everything's just misinformation. Oh, uh, see? Uh, see? Look at what this guy doing now. <laughs> All right. You know oh, what we really got here? Data, misinformation. No, no, no. Okay. You know what? Tomorrow, uh, Jordan 14 video. And then uh, <laughs> we'll go from there. All right. Friday, Ross video. Discord, All right. says Jose. All right. We're done. Cool. See you guys. Bye. Go ahead and get it.